One day after police named the officer who killed Patrick Leoya, activists are marching in downtown Grand Rapids ahead of tonight's city commission meeting. 13 on your side, Andrea Flores is live at the scene of the demonstration. Andrea? Val and Juliet, the crowd here at Pearl and Monroe Center has grown and we are headed to City Hall for the City Commission meeting at 7 o'clock tonight. Now community members are expected to speak during public comment directly to city leaders for the first time since Officer Christopher Scher's name was released in the shooting death of Patrick Leoya. Tonight, activists are calling for Scher to be charged and prosecuted. Chief Eric Winstrom sat down with us earlier this afternoon and he said he doesn't know if Scher has been interviewed yet by Michigan. Michigan State Police or the timeline of their investigation. He shared that releasing Schur's name early wouldn't interfere with the investigation and he wanted to put down rumors floating around on social media about the officer's identity. Well, I'll tell you, and at the early press conference that we had releasing the video, you saw that the officer's face was not covered. So we knew early on being, you know, this is a big town, but a lot of people know each other in this town. We thought that he would eventually be identified early. Again, we are headed to City Hall for that City Commission meeting, and that starts at 7 o'clock. We will be streaming that live on our website, 13onyourside.com. Reporting live in Grand Rapids, Andrea Flores, 13 on your side.